to reduce the budget by twenty seven hundred I have to take my question twenty seven hundred twenty dollars in what, no, what twenty seven seventy on forty five eighty nine dash five <coughs> to make it back to sixty five thousand which which letter bro? oh you so you're talking a, a. Okay. yes a Professional sculptures. Forty-five eighty-nine dash five. Make it back to sixty-five dollars. Okay. Your motion is for twenty-seven hundred twenty dollars for line four nine eight nine dash five. Do I have a that correct? small a? Small a. Yeah. I will second for discussion. All right. Now discussion. <coughs> Having voted originally for the budget that was previously approved tonight, I'd like to give you my reasoning for that vote. We were told by Mr. Grady that the cost of getting the artists, the cost of the CN, the cost of housing the artists, and other incidental expenses had gone up. Mm -hmm. And that's my distinct memory so of why we voted this adjustment this year. <coughs> okay. Richard? The function of this board, we are the budget committee. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Our function here is either probably to recommend or not recommend the budget that is given to us and either recommend that it be forwarded on to the voters for further, further deliberation, mm -hmm. just like we do with the regular budget. Mm -hmm. Not if we change it. Not if we change it. This, this we budget, are, this budget should, we have already recommended the way the budget stood. We recommended, <laughs> we recommended it to the public to hearing, the, We recommended right? it to the public to the hearing. Public the hearing. public has the right to get up Correct. there and speak, and we have the right we thereafter to reopen the line. This has not discussion. even been brought to the attention of the village district yes, uh, it public. We had a public no, meeting. No, the budget itself. The budget. Yes, we had a public meeting. Well, it has to be brought before the precinct. That's right. Two in order ago. to be brought here. All right. You can't bring I'm that here. Yeah, Richard, make his point, please. I, mean, I don't passed. think he's fit. My point is that on our, at our annual meeting, yes. at the last, month, last Friday of this month, yeah. Article says, Article 1, Article 2, see if the district will vote to accept the budget submitted by the budget committee. Mm -hmm. I, am, I am saying that the budget that we, uh, that we should be submitting is the way it stands right now. But we're not done. We recommended it. No, we no, recommended no. it. No. We're, not, we're not done. We are not done until after we take into consideration those who come to us during public hearing. So that is why we yeah. have public hearing. We went through the budget as we went through our budget in town. That's right. And at the end, if you remember, of the budget, we did make some recommendations, mm -hmm. and we did choose to change some, at least yeah. one Just thing that I remember. Point of clarity. And that budget was forwarded on to the vote. Will be forwarded on to the voters next yes. Tuesday. But Richard? we are still in the process. May I ask you a question? I you haven't got the. Are you suggesting? I, excuse me. I'm going to let anybody speak first who has not spoken yet on this. I wish. Stevens had his hand up for the past 15 right. minutes. Okay. I just want to clarify, <laughs> make sure that it's understood, because we can you have to use the proper words. Okay? <coughs> we had a legally posted workshop. Okay, it wasn't a public. It was a public meeting, but it was a workshop for the commissioners and the. Which is a public meeting. The person, the, well, they can decide in a workshop who's going to sure. have any have, who's going to yeah. input okay it's a public now, meeting the yeah. private contractor that we are hiring mm -hmm. the village district has come to us and said here's what I'm going to charge you this year hmm. it's just like we contract with the fireworks company or we contract with seashell entertainment for a series of um, of concerts during the summer he's a he's a private contractor okay we sign a contract or the the, uh, the voters will ultimately decide um, who's going to you know if we're gonna if we're gonna ha actually have this budget but this is whatever reasonings that Greg had which Bob just explained he explained to what the Commission is at that a uh, workshop that his costs are increasing. 
So no, his, that's, well, so so his his proposed contract for this year for the sea, the uh, sand sculptures, and the the commissioners decided that they were in going to contract sand sculpt professional sand sculptures. That's the name of the yeah. contractor. Okay, and that's the amount that was agreed upon. So. If you need a little bit of clarification then, be careful with words because, you know, make sure you're, it was a workshop and make sure that you understand that yeah, Greg, workshop Greg somebody, hearing. Know, somebody already pointed out that, that Greg didn't give himself a raise. He's a contractor. He proposed a contract to the village district. Okay. And as he explained it that night, okay, that's a raise. To, to her. First. Okay, not to me, please. Bob, are you speaking? Anything? Anything? Uh, I don't think we gave Greg a raise. We don't employ Greg. What we Greg entered into an agreement with Greg to do, do is provide a service for X amount of dollars. Mm -hmm. A raise, technically would be if we were paying Greg's I'm salary his word. and we increased the amount of his salary by X amount of dollars, that would be a raise. We allowed more money in this budget for the simple reason Greg told us the expenses of putting on the sculpture event had gone up. And we accepted that as a legitimate argument for the, uh, the difference in the budget this year. It was in no way uh, voted on as a raise. No one considered it as a raise for Greg. It was a cost of doing business adjustment. It was an expense Greg would incur that was greater this year than the year before. But he's not an employee. Oh, clearly. no. No, not he's an clearly an independent. paid by the village district. He's, he's an he's independent contractor. This is the $65,000 goes to who? It goes to his corporation to perform professional sand sculptures as and contract, provide a not service. As, not as an employee. And on top of that, he makes money by getting 15%. That's a separate issue. Let's finish with this one first, and then I'll give you the floor on that one. Huh? All right. <coughs> Basically, we have an incident into a contract with an independent contractor who has a prior record of performing well for us to do something. Mm -hmm. And this year he said, to do that, I need this adjustment. Mm -hmm. We felt his proposal was reasonable, and we accepted it. Nowhere in the discussion was there any consideration of giving Greg a raise. It wasn't part of it. No. I okay. Joe. No. Okay. Sure. I I kind of agree that you know, you budgeted sixty five last year and it actually cost you sixty seven seventy. So No, that's what he's proposing for this year. You budgeted Okay, I see something. Yeah. But to me, it's a contractor. You're paying his business. It's up to his company to give him the raise. He's not actually giving himself the raise. It's the company that he works It's for. his company. And that's up to his company to do that. It's up to his company to charge Correct. what they want to charge. All right. I you know, he might have said it was a raise. He explained it to you as his expenses went up. I mean... Some people don't get into semantics. Mm -hmm. um, it is an increase. He might have been better to just say it was an increase. We might not be having any discussion on it. Mm -hmm. But as an independent contractor, he can put any amount on yeah. there that he wants. Mm -hmm. And it's up to the commissioners to say yay and nay. And in this case, I guess you guys felt that he did a good job. He was worthwhile. If that's what he felt he needed for that contract, then that was the amount you were putting forward. Um, I'm coming around again, but I'm going to start down at this end with Sonny, who just came yeah, in. No, I'll, I'll have to pass because I missed most of the discussion. So. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I'd, I'd like to uh, get some clarification on what Richard said. Uh, Richard, uh, you, you began saying something that I wasn't clear whether you were suggesting that this committee has authority to reduce the budget or not. Uh, can you speak? That, that's my point. I, I think that this budget, uh, I'm not allowed to interact with. I yield to you for the purpose of answering my question. Right. And I yield to all of you so we can get this done. So we'll get it. <laughs> my feeling is that this budget, as, as presented to us, 
is for us to recommend forward it on to the voters. Recommend or not recommend. And I would think that any adjustments to this budget as the way it stands should be up to the village district residents at our annual town meeting. Yeah, okay, uh, thank you for that. But ultimately, too. ultimately at the VD meeting, annual meeting, mm -hmm. uh, they can decide whatever they want, regardless right. of what we mm -hmm. do. That's right. My, my question to get clarification was whether you think this budget committee has authority to change the number or not. We do. Now that wasn't Maybe clear whether you have the authority, you, authority you, but I okay so we do okay so thank you I just wanted to be clear on that be, point now on the on the point of the raise clearly it's a raise above the previous year now Mr. Ladd said that there was a contract this is a written contract yes it is yeah. it's a written contract well, so you have a written contract mm -hmm. for services for a one-year period I assume yeah. so you do this every year you do a new contract another contract this year so I really don't see an issue here I just don't see it there is a problem. I, uh, just right, I'm going to add yeah. something in between the two of you before we go any further because I want to make one point very clear to everybody and there should be no question we are this budget committee is the overseers of <coughs> the town the SCU and the precinct. You're here tonight because we technically make the budget, which means we can reduce it. Mm -hmm. And where we see necessary, we will reduce it. But it is not autonomous by itself out there. These three entities come before us. That's why we're here tonight. So I would want everybody to be perfectly clear on what the authority of this committee is. Now, did I interrupted you? Yes. Okay. Could you? I think that I think that what's what's occurring here is really the result of confusion. Mm -hmm. uh, several years ago, a certain citizen came before the VD commissioners and suggested that they do a formal meeting in February to go over the budget in detail for their citizens. Uh, Commissioner Chairman Rage did in fact do that for a couple of years and even said this was very productive because it avoided all kinds of confusion at the annual meeting etc and this confusion that's occurring tonight I suspect wouldn't have occurred at all if that took place this year as it has in the previous years I would strongly recommend that they uh, revert to that practice in subsequent years and with that I'll say I don't have a problem I don't see any problem here with regard to the raise, it was a raise, but it's a contractual situation negotiated annually. I assume it's already signed, so I would question whether we can not fund a contract. I mean, that kind of gets another area. I think we need to move forward with this, quite frankly. Okay. Coming around the table, there it was. The chairman is correct. This budget committee has authority over three <coughs> governmental entities, town, school, district and precinct it's the responsibility of the school district the town of Hampton and the village district to get together estimated expenditures and revenues in order to present that information to this budget committee and as I say and you've heard me those of you who sat here have heard me say many times the budget preparation is for the purpose of bringing it to the public hearing you make the motion to bring the budget to the public hearing the only reason we're sitting here is so the public has a chance to have some input before the final product is produced the budget committee and only the budget committee makes the three budgets so there's no impediment at all to the budget committee Re reviewing and reconsidering anything that's brought up during the public hearing. You had your public hearing on the town and, and school budgets over at the junior high, and things were discussed afterward and then finalized or not. And to make it clear, if you, it is not brought up during the public hearing, then we do not go back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, so, so there is finality to when we're done yeah. tonight. So this is so brought up. moving on. Rich, do you have another question? Yes, I, I have a question. Oh, oh. I'm sorry, David. Oh, I'm sorry, go ahead, David. Coming around. 
No, I would just like to say that I think the sand sculpture event <coughs> is a wonderful event that is well managed. Um, it's growing year by year. I think it is great for the reputation of our town to have it. I think this is a modest increase, and I would trust the commissioners to have already gone through this, and I rely on their expertise to say it was a worthwhile endeavor. So I am planning on voting to maintain the expense as stated in the budget. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's clarify something here. We're looking at a line item that says Professional Sculptures LLC. Mm -hmm. It does not say salary for X or Mr. Smith. As uh, Bobby, you explained that this is a contractual agreement with the, between the Village District and Sand Sculptures LLC for them to provide a certain contractual obligation bring in the sand sculptors, pay for their accommodations, uh, the prize money. So when you say, when somebody says it's a raise, it's not a raise. It's an increase of the operation or to fulfill that contract. Now, I understand the prize money, I believe, has been increased this year, hasn't it, over last year? Is it the same? The prize money is the same. But the cost of operation for this contractual company has increased, mm -hmm. and I assume that's why the commission has agreed to increase mm -hmm. the budget for Professional Sculptures LLC, not necessarily a raise for the operator of that organization. Is that correct? That's correct. We uh, never considered this as an employee-employer relationship. We don't use the term raise in that sense. We would approach it as the cost of this contract had increased for the reasons that it That's raised. exactly yeah. the point I'm making. It is not a raise. That's an increase of a contractual agreement that you've made between the Hampton Beach Village District and Professional Sculptures LLC. Okay. Madam Thank Chairman, you. I move the question. Thank you. What was the question? See, we have oh, the one that you seconded. Okay. We Got have it. the right, motion that. on the table. Discussion. All right. We Thank have you. the motion on the table to reduce. Um, to move the question. It's like non-debatable. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. So now we take a vote. Well, we need a second on the motion. We, Mr. All right. Collins. So now let's on. take a vote on this. So can, I get, can I get a clarification? No, moving the what question. Are we, what, are what are we voting, voting on? on? All right, wait question. a minute. With ten people talking. Moving right. the question is not debatable. Mr. Collins and I have moved the question so we can. So I understand we have to that. Share we, how we, what's, to what are we voting discussion. on? To end reduce discussion. End debate. Okay. And, and then we vote. Okay. We uh, have. It's your choice. I mean, it's entirely a chair's prerogative to say the discussion is sufficient. Let's do the vote. It's entirely your prerogative. You don't need to have a motion and a vote on moving the question. But we do have it's a motion. It's not required. It could be done, yes, but it's not required. All right. The chair has that discretion. When you're done talking, because this is a public hearing. No, it isn't. The public it's hearing the public is closed. Hearing. Public it's hearing is closed. It is the wrap-up to the public hearing. And when you're all done mm -hmm. with your legalese, we can get back to real business here, quite honestly. Can we vote now? Well, I think that's what I was saying before you interrupted. I just wanted to be now clear. Now that we're okay. back on Great. course, yes, we will go back to the vote. Repeating the motion that is on the table for a reduction of $2,720. That was moved and seconded again by Pat Collins. All those in favor of that reduction? Oh. No. That's, that's, that's not the motion. No, 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 no. To move the question. No, well, but that has yeah, apparently been withdrawn in the interests of finishing of what we're doing. In the interest of time efficiency, we're moving on to the vote of the motion yes. itself, yes. okay? Yes. Okay. I, think I just said that. I know. Are you all done? <laughs> so, uh, move the question to a vote. Well, you know what? Quite honestly, between people coming to this meeting late, all right, and what's going on right now, I find it disrespectful. I find it disrespectful when I get an email that says that the meeting was canceled and moved to another date. Yeah, it was moved to today. All right, we'll discuss no, that wasn't. later. No, it was moved to a further date, and that's why I was late. So thank you. Back on the vote. I'm calling for a vote. All right, all those in favor of the reduction on this line. 
Opposed? Abstain. We have to <laughs> no, it's, good. No. it's okay, Steve. It no, okay. it was okay. All right. We just reduced the line. It's okay. Right. Right. The motion fails. The yeah. line will not be reduced. Now, Brian, you had another question. Not at this time. So all issues are resolved. Not at this time. Is there any further discussion? I think is what the chair no. is asking. Okay. No, I have no further comment on this. I'm happy with the budget. And mm -hmm. with the budget. Well, we've gone through the public hearing.